no idea how heavy this is. I might just go weigh it just to prove to you guys how heavy this bag is. We're going to the airport. Goodbye, room. Hey. Past security and we're heading to the gate. There's probably nothing open because it's super early, but let's hope. We just landed, but we board in five minutes. And it's the oldest part of the world. We need to say Thomas for the local time is 11.45 a.m. That's an end your carry on. We're here. Okay guys, we are here in our rented Jeep in St. Thomas, Virgin Islands. And we are currently driving on the left side of the road because that's how they do it here. We're gonna head to the hotel and check in. <laughs> Let's oh, see. Let's yes. Here's the first bedroom. Ooh, balcony. I was hoping you got a balcony. Oh wait, this is my room? Yes, but that's a front balcony. That's okay. You don't get the beach. That's yeah, fine. Sorry. That's fine. <laughs> oh yeah, look at that view. Wait, there's three balconies. Yeah, we have a nice view. There's three balconies. See, this is awesome. This is so cool. And there's the hot tub over there. Not that I'll be needing that. Maybe at night, maybe at night, because it's really hot right now. Look at how blue that water is. Here is this main living room, the kitchen, my parents' room, a big, big, huge desk, okay. Closet. Oh, and they have Netflix on these TVs? That's gonna be nice. You guys, I got a king bed all to myself. Let's go. Oh my gosh, this is perfect. Even though it's windy, I said Wendy. Even though it's windy, it is very hot. I'm gonna be sleeping like this. <laughs> we are in St. Thomas now, and it's just my parents and I, and we're gonna be doing a lot of fun stuff while we're here. It is day two. We are heading off to jet ski, and unfortunately my mom doesn't feel well, so she's staying in, but we're gonna have a lot of fun. We both love jet skiing, and it's gonna be great. We're here. Here are the jet skis. Am I even filming? Yes, I am. We are jet skiing right now. Oh my gosh, wait, look, do you see that? That was like a baby shark. Day three, I'm heading down to get some iced coffee and then we are going on a boat. Oh, look at that view. Ooh, looks so good. This is really good. Okay guys, this is the boat and dad, what are we gonna be doing? We're gonna be, do whatever we want. We can <laughs> go wherever we want. Uh, I'll probably go over to St. John maybe. They've got some of the nicest beaches. Hi life. little puppy. Oh, she's just chilling. Yeah, we really need to take the dogs to the beach. That'd be so fun. So this beach that we are at right now is known for its sea turtles. And last time we were here, we saw a bunch. So that was really cool. And he also said that there is an octopus around here that he's been feeding. So I'm hoping to see that. We saw a few stingrays, a bunch of sea turtles with the little sharks on top of them. Why do the sharks and fish always like hover over them? All right, so those are remoras. Oh, and is that what it's like eating off of it? Oh, okay, I gotcha. And they're just fine with it? Yeah, because they're both getting something out of it. Yeah, yeah okay. Uh, what would you rate that? So Maho, our first beach, hard to rate the first one because you have nothing to judge it on, but uh, compare it against. But I think personally, the above area was the most crowded on St. John. So to me, that's a negative. I'll give it a five out of 10. And then the clarity of the water was only like a five out of 10. It was a little murky and it may all be like that today. But and then but the what was underneath, seeing the stingrays and the sea turtles, that was cool. I had no yeah. idea those turtles were getting be that big so I give it like a seven yeah yeah I'd agree with that how was that the difference between the two the clarity this time was like a 
seven or eight. It was way clear. So that was cool. I got out right away because I get really cold and I was just, I was miserable. I wanted to stay in, but I was just too cold. I did my Bible study and read some devotion. I really enjoyed that, so don't feel bad that I no, came oh, in. Oh, not at all. So I may get him more by myself. But anyway, so that was, a uh, clarity was great, seven or eight. Okay, we're at our next stop. We are going to eat on the pier. Oh, it's so cute. Thanks. You too, have a good day. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Awesome, thank you. <laughs> Tell me if I need to angle myself different, just try to get the best background. My dad cannot take photos for the life of him. If I had some, I'll bring it out. If I can, I'll show it though. Got a little burnt. We're at dinner. Look at this. Yeah, it doesn't do it justice either. Guys, look at that rainbow. Okay, we are doing water sports today. What are we doing first? Paddleboard, I think. Secret Harbor Beach again, and oh, it's gorgeous, and the water is so warm. Look how pretty this all is. Okay, guys, we are going to go swimming with the dolphins, and we're also doing this, it's called snuba. It's like snorkeling, but you can be underwater. We're here. <laughs> little baby shark. Oh good, it says they'll all eventually be released. Allows them to grow up safely. Oh, that's awesome. Thank goodness, because it says it's designed, the th sharks grow up in here, but then they release them in the ocean so they can grow up safely in here. Which, thank goodness, because I did not want to be a part of something that was keeping them captive. <laughs> Guys, I see a dragon. There's so many of those big iguanas here. Bearded dragons, I don't know what they're called. Look, it's a little puffer fish. Okay, I'm gonna do some laps. It's nice because there's literally no one in this pool. That's why I love getting up early. It's my last day here and I had literally so much fun. Thank you all so much for watching this video and I will see you all next week. Bye.